you see um, a group of the construction workers kind of turn their back to you for a moment and start moving away. You see one of the sort of old foreman, it's kind of like squat Irish looking guy, like white hair kind of foreman, got a clipboard. It's going like, yeah, so we're gonna take this down because we gotta get the, so the landscapers are gonna come through here. They're coming in from 68th down to 63rd. So this is all gonna be campus, but but we gotta get that leveled out because we, the, the, we gotta get the back hallway in here to uproot this tree over here. Uh, and they sort of move a little ways away, giving you an opportunity to huck a ninja star. I huck a ninja star and I try to hit, um, you said there was somebody with like a, like a happy face. I try to hit him like right between the eyes. You mean a person or a poster? Oh, a poster. Definitely not a, <laughs> okay. definitely not, I'm not committing Cody's a murder. Cody's kills a oh, man. Yeah. Just, yeah. Cody's a real defacing property guy. He's he's the guy who you'd like, go, like sneak out at night with in high school, would just start like kicking a mailbox. You'd be like, dude, stop. <laughs> Cody, you huck a ninja star straight into the posters face. Um, as you do so, you hear the thunk, um, and you see that the foreman whips around and says, hey, hey, it's that, it's that fucking kid, kid, you get the fuck out of here, get the fuck out of here, buddy. You, I'm not going fucking anywhere, dude, you get out of here. Oh, I get out of here? Yeah. Tell me, give me one good reason I shouldn't walk across this fucking street and kick your ass. Where's your sword, bro? Where's my fucking, I don't need Where's a your fucking sword? sword. I have 12. I'm gonna rip that sword out of your hands and shove it up your ass, kid! Yeah, you can try. And I pull out the Buster sword. Um, immediately behind you, you hear whoop whoop, and you see. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, is it illegal to fucking hit paper with ninja stars? Is it fucking illegal? Um, you see, yeah, you see the cops come out and say, hey man, we clocked that Buster sword from a while away. We're, you can't be, you can't pull out people. And you, can, you see the guy, the foreman across the street goes, yeah, that's right, kid, you're a long way from Transylvania, asshole. Yeah, I'm not from fucking Transylvania. I worked at the fucking Hot Topic that you're fucking destroying. So actually, I belong here and you belong on the internet because gladiators from the fucking internet? You Fuck see another you, dude, where's your sword? You see <laughs> another construction worker goes, hey, where's your, he goes, how come you're out in the daylight, Dracula? What the fuck is going on, man? Uh, I'm actually like Blade. I'm a fucking daywalker, dude. Read a comic. <laughs> <laughs> um, you, you get hassled by the cops. Do you think, do you think Cody has, this is by the way, Cody, Night Angel Walsh. Um, <laughs> do we think Cody has a, uh, uh, like a permit for this replica Buster, Buster sword? <laughs> no. Absolutely <laughs> <laughs> not. Yeah, the, the cops fully jack this sword. You said uh, I couldn't have the fucking blade sword. This one's different. You see, <laughs> they go, look, man, it's really simple. You you if you're gonna if you're gonna have a replica weapon, you either can't have it filed down to an edge like this, or it needs to be double bladed. Single bladed weapon in the state of New York is an illegal weapon. You can't unless you are transporting it, right? Yeah, I'm transporting it. To that dude's fucking head, and okay, so that's to the so, construction worker. So that that absolutely is uh, is uh, assault. That's verbal. That's verbal assault. That's a that's a this threat. This is real assault. They're taking cars and shit and driving it like construction vehicles and driving it around my fucking job, man. Okay, I'm just trying to do my job. Okay, you're okay. This, uh, sir, I don't need to know a thing. So about I'm allowed you. to have nunchucks, is what you're saying. Again, if you are transporting them to a martial arts studio where you are licensed and, and have the insurance for that, yes. Okay, so absolutely. if I sign up for a fucking Taekwondo class, I can just freak out with these weapons. Is that what you're telling me? You can never freak out with these weapons. <laughs> Not that I would freak out, I'm fucking very controlled. <laughs> the cops, uh, you see the, the guy leans in and says, look man, I'm gonna let you off with a warning because frankly, I don't find you threatening. So, <laughs> so <It's> fucking weird. <laughs> Do you not find the devil threatening? <laughs> um, you know that there's a way to get into the hot topic, just not with this many people around. There's so much good shit left in there that didn't get moved back out. And you know that they're just gonna raise this place to the ground and junk all of that shit. If anyone touches those Jack Skellington hoodies, I'm gonna fucking freak out. And I just like kick a Halloween uh, decoration. On the you just kick a full pumpkin that like a, co <laughs> like a coffee shop had carved for their stoop. <laughs> Who fucking night angel your way into the empty mall? You are back. The tiles where once Taco Bell was consumed and happy, happy shoppers moved to and fro, all of their favorite stores brought into one central location. You see the hot topic before you. I take my soul edge oh my from my gosh. back, I put it down, and I take a knee, I put it back on, and I enter the hot topic. You can get like a couple loads done, um, but, but what do you go to grab first? Um, you gotta go Breaking Benjamin, POD posters, 
um, you all the it. pro wrestling t-shirts, uh, Adventure Time uh, sort of hats and whatnot, <laughs> uh, studded belts. Um, uh, <laughs> under under the studded belts and some of the wrestling tees. <laughs> this is from a very Cody is from a very particular time. I don't think Hot Topic has most of these things anymore. <laughs> the Adventure Time hack sold sold. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and you see that this devil goes, oh, holy fucking shit, dude! What the fuck, dude? What the fuck? Like, what the are, fuck? Where am I? Are you? You're in. <laughs> you're home. It's <laughs> where darkness is born. This is Hot Topic. Are you Lucifer? Because I've been fucking waiting for you my whole life. <laughs> you see? This devil looks at you and says, <laughs> <laughs> You see the devil? Are you looks Lucifer <laughs> because I've been waiting for you my whole life? <laughs> you see the devil? Oh my god. Um, you see the, the devil goes, uh, okay. Yeah, I'm I'm Lucifer. I'm I'm, I'm the real devil. Uh that I mean you, yeah. Okay, so this is the real world. You're a human mortal. I'm the devil. I'm not asking these questions. I'm not asking these questions. I'm saying this. This is all. This is true. You're, I, okay. Holy shit! Ah, the mortal world. Okay, what? Oh, mortal. Answer this riddle. What city are we in? City of Sin. Uh, Las Vegas. City. No. Um, <laughs> the other city of Sin. It's fucked up here. Oh, we're new. Please let me work we're, for you. Please. We're new. We're, you want to work for me? Let me work for you. Lucifer, please, we need to kill Gladiator and save them all, and I will sell my soul just in a second. Holy Fucking Michael. shit! You just broached that top. I didn't have to like <laughs> set anything just up. Whatever. I do. I need to shit. like give blood or what? yeah, blood. Yeah, blood's great. Yeah, shit. Okay, <laughs> hold on. Um, do you have a, do you have something we can do? You have something we can, I we can just run? like Andrew WK it. I just start like I just like grab like a brick or something. Just, fuck. Fuck, no, fuck. dude, no, shut up, stop. What? No, listen, do you have something to write on? Something we, with a blank, blank that we can write on? Uh, yeah, I found this weird fucking book that you came out of. That not could... that, the, not the book. How about this? You see, he goes and grabs a WWE poster and un <laughs> unfolds Whoa. it. Whoa! Dude, oh wait, okay, it's Roman Reigns, it's fine. <laughs> so just on the back of a Roman Reigns poster, you, uh, he goes, okay, um, uh, in exchange for working, for the privilege of working for me, you will sell me your soul. Full deal. <laughs> well, you need to give me like powers and shit, man. Like yeah. we have to like fucking kill. We have yes, to get powers, rid of powers. We have powers. to get them all back. I will Does give you powers. Back? Great, great, great. And just you see, he says, hold out your hand. Okay, just I have to be able to like freak out and be strong. You got <laughs> it. Pin prick, pin prick of blood. You're good. I just give my hand. <laughs> You see, pricks your finger and says, all right, now put it on the dotted line. So there's like some Sharpie dots that he just put on the back of his poster. He's like, keep using his hooves to keep it from rolling up. All right, Lucifer, I sell my soul to you. I write, at first I write Night Angel, and then I realize that might be binding, and then I change it to Cody. Um, you you do it, you see, he goes, great. I'm going to sign my name as Bazathrax. Don't worry about that. And then you see, signs Bazathrax on the line. And he goes, Wah! it turns into fire. He goes, holy shit, I can feel it. There's, there's no, the, the, the infernal realms can't reach here. There's some kind of hex preventing them from. Cody, sorry, Night Angel. We, we could do a lot of good work here, man. It's wide open field, baby. There's no one else doing what we're doing in town right now. Let's bring the flames of hell to raise Gladiator and from the ashes, the mall will grow. Hell yes, great, good job. So Lucifer, um, are we, so now that we're working together, are we just gonna get like a bunch of your fallen angels and we're just gonna go like kick those construction guys asses or what? Cool, so, I'm gonna, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run a little bit of recon and I'm gonna get back to you about all these plans, okay? What you should do for right now- You are now, Lucifer, right? A hundred percent, dude, a hundred percent. Would never lie to you about that. I am the person you mentioned but we got like, like you know how you go by Night Angel, right? Yeah. So, so that's like a code name, right? So Lucifer is a very powerful name, and so we're gonna go by my code name, which is Bazathrax. Okay, it's a secret name only you, only you and me know about Bazathrax. it. About it. Okay. Great. You go home. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna some snooping. But you got all kinds of powers now. Don't even worry about it. Okay. Um. All right. Uh, Bazathrax. <laughs> like, what's your thing with the mall and what's happening with the mall right now? What's not happening with the mall right now is <laughs> So This is gonna I be poetic, out, isn't it? <laughs> I worked at the Hot Topic. Um, 
I was I was a mall goth. Um, yeah. All my friends were there. I had friends who worked at Spencer's. I had friends who worked at Zoomies. Hell, I even had friends who worked at PacSun, even though I don't like the sun. Um, and then people started buying shit online, and it was really fucked up. Um, first, uh, Spencer's closed, and then Whoa. Zoomies not long after, Whoa. and then PacSun, and Hot Topic stayed right till the end, but then they just shut the whole mall down, and now Gladiators come in with their, oh, we're on the internet, but we're gonna, we need a fucking campus. So, fucked they're, just, up. so they're just mowing it all down and making a fucking Gladiator campus? Yeah, they're making like, they said it was gonna be like a big job thing or some fucking bullshit. Like, they're just, like, they're crushing all the small businesses like Sears, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, yeah, up. totally. <laughs> Little like, mom and pop shops you guys, like Sears. <laughs> Um, yeah, like Sears and the McDonald's is fucking closed. I have to walk like a <laughs> fucking two miles to get to McDonald's. Uh, th thank you, Night Angel. <laughs> that was deeply. Don't thank me. Don't get used to it. We're only allies for now. Wait, is it Night Angel with a K? Or with the just oh. an N? <laughs> That's a really That's, good question. That's super interesting because both are super fucking cool. You can, you guys, I just yell like through the car. You guys can just call me whatever cool shit you want. Okay, I, Cody. I'm gonna call yeah. you Cody. <laughs> Cody. Yeah, Cody seems to suit you pretty Cody well. Cody works. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm gonna need Cody to give me a... Uh, <laughs> Cody is uh, fully the same level as everyone else. I don't know why he sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, he doesn't uh, suck. He just hasn't had yeah. the opportunity to shine. Did you yeah, ever think he, he would be playing a? Did you ever think he'd be playing a D and D character named Cody? <laughs> uh, okay. I got a five. Uh, Fourteen. I got 14. a. Uh, tw I got a twenty-five. Fourteen, twenty-five. What Cody get? Five. <laughs> For real? Cody. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not wise, believe it or not. Oh, um, Cody. Cody, I'm gonna. That's my Cody, stat. Cody, I'm gonna need you to roll a one d four for me. Oh no! Is there anything I could do as this is being... There is nothing. You and Sophia are fine. You and Sophia yeah. are... Two? Cody, you age 20 years. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Cody? This kid's oh. life, in the course of a fucking day, he made a deal with a bad devil, <laughs> tried magic for the first time, what failed happened? when he is now a 40-year-old man? He's a 46-year-old Hot Topic manager. <laughs> Oh my God. I didn't this doesn't even have to do with the fact tragic. that he sold his soul. This is just a separate thing that happened. <laughs> um, uh, you think are, are, that rat shit is gonna happen when you find out that fucking magic and devils are real? Um, uh, hey, you, we can do something about that, all right? There, there's, a, there's a magical thing to, uh, that we can do. Just keep going. <laughs> cool, I feel tired. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my st I suddenly can't handle my diet of just Pizza Hut. Oh. Uh, also, <laughs> Cody, you take another uh, 10 points of necrotic damage. <laughs> Cody is just barfing everywhere because he had like four monster energy drinks today. He was like coming out of his 20s, like still having like a teenager's diet and is just <laughs> falling apart right now. Oh, oh. <laughs> um, oh my yes. I don't, I, I went through all of my stuff. <clears throat> All right. Uh, well, I guess we. I guess we'll start. Want to just freak out, and kill ghosts? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, don't. I don't think you should be messing around with ghosts anymore, Cody. But uh, yeah, it feels like I mean, this Kason, is. You do see that Cody is the is the caboose and is stuck in the room where the two ghosts just came back. Oh, they. Yeah, this is this is my fight, Kingston. <laughs> uh, Cody, I think we gotta run, right? Yeah, we should be moving forward, Cody. All right. Um, uh, you have Cody. Cody do you have? you have anything that's gonna get us really far? Yes. Oh shit. I'm Wait, really? I'm slash these ghosts. Oh, okay. I'm gonna use Omni Slash. I'm so I'm gonna use my final Why do I listen? I'm gonna go Cody, all out. What are you at? Um, Cody gives a knowing nod to Kingston, like this is all part of the plan. Um, and then he snags his giant sword, Gears of War style, so that sparks come up as he runs across. Um, and he runs backwards to the ghosts. Um, oh, Cody. I'm just so then, worried now that he's 47, all of his cultural references are gonna be so different than his, the people who are surely, now his peers. Surely they are all uh, out of game. They are all references that I remember from high school and um, they already it's don't hold so up. It's so sad that he's a 47 year old man running like an anime character. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> right, man. Um, but then there's Breaking Benjamin, which is yeah. which is yeah. awesome. And then there's Lincoln mm -hmm. Park. And like some people are Chester guys, yeah. some people are Mike Shinoda guys. Personally, a Shinoda guy. <laughs> um, then when we're talking about pro wrestling, we've got the Hardy yeah. Boys. It's like, do you like the technical prowess Wait, of the, Matt from Hardy? The, hold on, the Hardy Boys from the book. Yeah, they they wrestle now. Is that who? <laughs> is anybody hearing this? Is anybody hearing this? Yes, my Fuck, son Nicholas dude. also like the Hardy Boy books. 
No, not those. No, they're not from. It's the. It's the. It's those, 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 those no, two it's children. Not, they're, not, they're not the like child. They're not the child sleuths. Okay, they're okay. fucking cool ass wrestlers who wear well, cool shit and do flips the off same ladders name and stuff. As the childhood sleuths. No, they're boys <laughs> with a Z. Oh. Okay. I'm gonna take off and find my sister. I think. <laughs> You could throw down here and get some shit going and nobody would be able to tell, dude. And here's the thing, I can't trade you to another devil in hell, but there are a lot of other renegades out there, other devils that have escaped the nine hells. And if you want, I could send some invites and we could get a fucking party going here, dude. You want to command lesser devils? You want, you know, imps and, and other kind of uh, minions and shit to do your dark bidding? You want that? Yes. Yes, absolutely. I fucking want that. <laughs> um, Why is he Cody, nodding Cody, to Cody, himself? Yeah, what, yeah. what do you want? I mean, we're Cody having is inside of the conversation, and it's I just heard you say yes. I want that. Inside voice, right Cody. Yeah. Okay. Also, I heard um, you say I'm going to pretend like we're not friends, mm. but inside we're super tight. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then you hooked me up. <laughs> <laughs> and then this is the best. The questing blade boom, booms out over the New York entrance of the Holland Tunnel, or rather the exit of the Holland Tunnel, and goes. Whosoever be most worthy of the questing blade shall wield the power of a true champion. It erupts into a twisted and barbed double-handed greatsword and shoots into Cody's hands. Cody's hands? <laughs> yes! What? Yes! Dude. What? Yes! Yes! Wait, how Not many swords sword, does dude? Cody have right now? <laughs> Cody, as you I'm... swing this sword, it full on makes like distorted heavy metal lightsaber sounds as you swing it, like. <laughs> um, <laughs> Cody's just making his own sounds. This Wait. is fucking awesome. This fucking rules. Wait, I'm so sorry. I thought that was for you. I I'm uh, so sorry. I wow. Dale doesn't even know Cody. It makes no Ricky, sense. Ricky, do you want my? I so I was actually going to use. Um, I have a replica sword of Frostborn from Warcraft Three that I was going to use. That I got at BlizzCon that I bought off a cosplayer. Um, so I was going to use that, or I have that other um, umbrella sword if you want, because like this one kind of chose me. Yeah, um, yeah. No, I know. Uh, uh, <laughs> Just like Cody, you, if, first yeah. off, uh -huh. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy. <laughs> uh, I'm so happy that the quest, the questing blade, uh, I found found you, <laughs> and I'm glad that you have it. And I, and I, I just wanted to be clear about that. Yeah, because that's true, and that's how I, just, I feel. I and feel like, also. Yeah. Sure, I'll take that umbrella sword. Cool. Sure. I would love it if you, you know, maybe we could stop swinging it so much right here. It's <laughs> much larger than the last sword you have. I just feel like the sword likes whatever I'm doing. It probably does. It probably does. <laughs> cool, oh, cool. this is so big. I'm going to go over here and stretch for a little bit. <laughs> so, Sophia, thank you so fucking much. This is like the coolest. Like, I bought swords on Etsy. I've tried to fucking make my own swords. Um, but, like, my parents wouldn't let me, like, mess with, like, fire and shit. So I couldn't do, like, blacksmithing mm -hmm. stuff. And then I tried to take a real class. But then I just, like, I got fucking bored. So I just started, like, <laughs> buying them and stuff. And, like, this is the first time I got one for fucking for free for except free. the other time and i got the umbrella sword it, but that it this one's free and that it okay i'll just hey. awkwardly quiet yeah <laughs> oh. <laughs> cody just know this you know it's a really special very impossibly special <laughs> weapon that has meant something very powerful to a lot of people and i hope that it brings out the best in you this, <laughs> this is the coolest sword i've had since I, my buster sword was confiscated <laughs> and, <laughs> Unless I can get another Buster Sword, which that one thing was custom made on Etsy. That took me a fucking like eight months to get. So, so that months, would outrank this sword, you think? It, de it depends. I think Ricky just shatters a statue next to I was going to say, Sophia watches this, this little piece of shit wielding Sorry, the weapon was... that her husband used to come find her, and she just goes and punches a wall. Sorry, I was stretching and I, I, I had think... the dynamic stretching. I think, Ricky, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm okay, so should we go? Coffee. Cody, this sword is so fucking sick. Uh, Zach, what is what is Kingston seeing when he looks at Ricky? Um, you're seeing the first real challenge Ricky has ever faced. <laughs> <laughs> Bound of madness to attempt to charm it so it has to attack Ooh. other creatures. Ooh, uh, Ooh yes. Amazing. There we go, Cody. There, there we go. go. Uh, and what Bring it around. This is, a, this is a wisdom. I am the true Jersey Devil. Uh, this is a, this is okay, a wisdom. Okay, again, not about you. <laughs> <laughs> this is a wisdom saving throw, correct? Yes. Okay. Um, uh, your DC is 16. 
Um, uh, this guy gets a, between myself, Zach, and Murph, only one of us was surprised by that interaction. And it was Mr. Brian Murphy. Mr. Brian Murphy was the only person who was surprised by the question. Because as much as I love a good joke and I love being that much of a little chaos demon, you have to know deep in your heart of hearts, I would never give the questing blade to Cody without first checking in with Zach about what he was thinking in terms of Ricky. So there was definitely some uh, collab between yeah. Zach and myself uh, uh, to spring this on Murph, who is really the person getting pranked here. We, we kind of had like, a, or, you know, going into this chapter, just like early discussions of things that could be fun. One of which being like, knowing more about Murph's character would be like, was like, it'd be funny if it went to him. I posted this on Instagram, but I feel like that clip that they posted of like, when we first find this out, <laughs> uh, where we're all just kind of like, what? I feel like we really are each like scanning the screen to check in with everyone. Like, is it okay that we're laughing? Are you okay? How, where are we? Because I think there's only like two of us laughing out loud, and then there are a few <laughs> silent, silent members of the party. He was sitting so still and so quiet, <laughs> so like just serene, just like I'm gonna wait for to find out. Well, it was just wild. It was like it was wild. It's his thing. It's, it's his thing. thing. It's his Season one, one, it's his thing. thing. He hangs out with it. It's his friend, and then it's just. I mean, and yeah, shoots out of her hand right, into sacrifice. the hands. Yeah. <laughs> It is a, per here's the thing is, it, for all of those reasons, it is a perfect setup for a joke. Like, I think that's what, in the conversations that me and Zach had about it ahead of time, it yeah. was like, because what is it, there's like some old adage about comedy of like, the perfect joke is something you couldn't, that, something that defies every expectation. You couldn't anticipate it. And then the moment it's happened seems inevitable, right? Yeah. Like that there is that thing of like, beforehand it's like, well, this is Ricky's question blade. This is the question blade It chose Ricky. It chooses someone who is the most worthy. Ricky yeah, is I the goodest. I don't, even think, I don't think we, I knew it could choose anybody else. I yeah, thought it was like a death okay. thing. I thought my man had to die before it like went anywhere else. Uh, <laughs> so it was just, yeah. I just thought uh, Cody was cool, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> it's really, it's really great. That's really something.